And we are in the Roadshow Kitchen this morning. The Breachway is here. Owner Craig Marr is here, and we are going to make some bolognese. But that is not it because he has loaded up the Roadshow counter with a ton of other great food. Thanks so much for coming in. Well, good to see you again. Always great, a pleasure. Great to see you, too. Um, you've had a good summer. We've had a good summer, uh, as, as good as we possibly can, given the conditions. But we're doing well, and, you know, I'm very happy, knock on wood, that right. we're doing as well as we are. I was telling you that if you can get a chance to go down there, go towards the Breachway, go down to Charleston. It's like a whole other world. It is beautiful. It's peaceful. And September, and September early October, it doesn't get any better. It really, it really that's so true. All right. Tell us what you're going to make. We're going to make a little bolognese sauce. Okay. So we have fresh uh, thyme, rosemary, oregano, and the sage, yep. uh, garlic, um, pancetta, the mirepoix, onion, carrot, celery, salt and pepper, San Marzano tomatoes. I only use San Marzano tomatoes. Right. Uh, we have a mixture of beef, pork, and veal, a little okay. bit more beef than the pork and the veal, mm -hmm. uh, white wine, and chicken stock. I always use white wine in my bolognese sauce. It gives a little bit more tang to it than the red wine does. Right, than the red wine does. Now, this is something easy that anyone could, uh, you could put this together tonight or this weekend or just go down to see you folks at the Breachway. You've got outdoor seating, you've got indoor seating, you've got you do takeout, you've got everything. we got it all covered. Everything, everything is covered. So if you want to do that, and then you have some other food, which we're going to get to in just a little bit. So do you want to start something off? Sure, we'll start the, get the bolognese going, get the right burner on. There all right, we go. load that up. A little olive oil in the bottom just to get started. Okay. All right. And that gets heated up. Then we'll put our, we start with, with our pancetta first, get a little base. And then once that's cooked through, then we'll start putting in the mirepoix and start layering things in. Got it. And then we hand squeeze our San Marzano tomatoes. And then, um, you know, we put beef in and then the tomatoes. And Craig, what is it that you like about those, those tomatoes? Those tomatoes are from a region in Italy, and the tomatoes are all grown in uh, the soil is very heavily volcanic. Okay. And it just gives a better flavor than any canned tomato I've ever had. Right. And look at the brightness. Look at the yeah. red vibrancy of those tomatoes. I, when I have it, I like it when it has a little, like, chunkiness to it, or, you know. Yeah. I, well, we, we, you can do it with an immersion blender, blender, or right. I like to just squeeze them by hand. Right, yeah. Looks delicious. All right, so we're going to put this together, and then go over all the other foods that we have, and check them out as well. Back to you. 